My channel hope you're all doing fine so today's video is gonna be a comparison of two different gels I'm gonna show you guys how I was able to slick down my natural hair and um, if you've not already please don't forget to support me by liking this video and please subscribe to my channel and also share this video with your friends so today I'm gonna show you guys how I was able to slick my natural hair using two different gels and I also decided to use this curly hair which is very beautiful the hair is from Wiggins hair company and it's um, the coils were pretty tight so I decided to loosen the coils a little bit. I used a little comb and just combed the hair out properly. So I decided to try the Eco Salad Gel and the Gorilla Snot Gel. I used the Eco Salad Gel right here and then the Gorilla Snot Gel right here. So you guys are going to tell me what you actually think about the way it looks. But personally, the fact that, apart from the fact that the Gorilla Snot Gel contains alcohol, the fact that when I'm applying it on my hair, so I see if I'm applying glue on my hair, I didn't really like the texture of it but with the Eco Gel we all know it's smooth and everything I think with the Gorilla Snot Gel it's gonna last a bit longer because the hair is not completely dry but the area that is a bit dry I can feel it's a bit hard it's harder so I think it's gonna last longer but at the end of the day to me they all gave me the same result I think Eco Gel is a little bit better so de I'm definitely gonna stick with Eco Gel definitely let me know what you guys think I'll really love to know what you guys think and um, let's just just get into the tutorial hi guys so I'm gonna start by spraying water on my hair because I want to start on the wet hair so you guys can see I'll be trying the eco styler gel and the gorilla snot gel first of all I'm gonna divide my hair into two equal half so then I'm gonna go ahead and apply my sheer um, moisture leave-in conditioner on one side I'll be using the Eco Styler Gel, on the other side I'll use the um, Gorilla Snot Gel. Then I'll apply a little bit of castor oil. And then I'm going to take a little section at the back and I'm going to start applying my gel. So I'm starting with the Eco Styler Gel, as I apply the gel, I'll comb my hair and then brush it through and then I'll section another part of hair and then just apply it like that because I want the gel to, you know, get to every part of my hair. As I apply it, I comb it through and I brush it and then I'm going to add it to the other one. And that's what I'm gonna keep doing. So from my view on the right, we have the Eco Styler Gel. My hair shrinks like crazy whenever I pour water on it. Whenever it's wet, it shrinks like crazy. So now I'm going to put them all together. And that's it for the Eco Styler Gel side. Now I'm going to go ahead and start with the Gorilla Snot Gel. As you guys can see, I sprayed a little bit of water on my hair and I'm going to start applying it. I'm going to repeat the same step. I'll apply it, comb my hair through, brush it through and then, you know, secure it. I'm going to go ahead and repeat the same thing in front. I 
and now I'm gonna go ahead and apply the Gorilla Snot Gel I really honestly do not like the texture of the Snot Gel like I said earlier on I think I'm just gonna stick with my Eco Styler Gel Sometimes my hair is just so difficult to lay down, seriously. So at the back, I just decided to bring everything together at the back. And then I'm going to put it in a low ponytail. So I'm going to go ahead and tie my scarf and then I'll do my makeup and come right back. So now I'm done with my makeup. The hair is not dry at all but I'm just going to work with it. So on my right side we have the Eco Styler Gel and then on the left side we have the Gorilla Snot Gel. Let me know what you think in the comment section. So like I said earlier on, I'll be using this short um, coily hair from Wiggins and as I told you guys, I decided to comb it out because ju I just want to loosen the coils a little bit so I decided to comb the bundle out very very well and then I'm going to attach uh, a thread on the end of each uh, of the bundle that way it will be easier for me to attach it to my bun So first of all, I'm gonna, you know, go around with the thread to secure the bundle very well. Then I'm gonna start going around with the bundle. And yes guys this is the final look i hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you so so much for watching and i'll see you guys very soon love you bye